Hey, welcome back to Central Valley Talk Live on this Thursday. It is the 28th of April. I'm Austin Reed coming to you from our Tower District Studios inside the Mike Briggs building. We thank you for joining us. Connect with me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, Austin Reed on air. Join in on the conversation. Man, I'm loving this weather. We finally cooled down and that temperature trend is going to continue through the rest of the week. This weekend, we're going to warm up just a little bit, but then next week, we're going to cool back down. So it's definitely a roller coaster. We are getting close to May. I don't know how that happened. That is just, that's unbelievable. Uh, let's bring in my next guest here in the one o'clock hour today. This is Melissa from Desk to Dusk. Welcome. Your second time on the show. My second time. Hi, Austin. Thanks Hi. for having me back. So, no, your husband was on just a few minutes ago. That was my husband. Yes. So if you didn't see everybody, um, you got to check out the video uh, on our Central Valley Talk YouTube page because that you, you guys are busy enough with that. I don't know how you're able to do this as well. So, but check out that video. Yeah, this is my baby, and that's his. Yeah, um, he's been coaching rugby for years, and right. um, we met over sports. And then, you know, I started Dust to Dusk when my daughter was born, about when she was about seven months old. When you know, is when I yeah. founded this. Yeah, uh, and now how old is she now? She just turned five. Wow. Yeah, See? I didn't officially launch until about a year after kind of developing the concept. But, um, yeah, so it's just about four years old now. Um, we were talking just before the interview today about one of the um, – an influencer that you worked with. Uh, today is her uh, – there, there's a special m meaning yeah. for today. What is it? Um, one of the very first brand ambassadors that I had or influencers that I worked with was Chesley Christ. Um, she is a former attorney and um, – turned Miss USA 2019, um, an extra TV car correspondent. But um, she was just incredibly supportive of my business when it was brand new. And, you know, being as as um, influential as she was, you know, on social media and all her platforms, um, she really helped me boost my business early on. Um, today's her birthday. Unfortunately, she did pass um, earlier this year. Okay. And... Um, you know, so everything on my social media, if you visit the page today, is kind of dedicated to celebrating her and her life. You know, she was just such an incredible human to interact with, even though our relationship wasn't, you know, a deep friendship. It was just really nice to have someone like her support me earlier on. So for everybody that um, maybe you didn't see you the first time, kind of go into detail about Desk to Dust. Sure. Desk to Desk is a purpose-driven brand for women in business. I cater to women professionals and entrepreneurs. Um, what the company's most known for is our business and evening wear. Um, and it's business and evening wear for women who are working to, I guess, stand out from the crowd in their industry. You know, there's every industry is so populated right now. And I wanted to create a wardrobe for women who are on the go and kind of wanted to set themselves apart. You know, so while we do have the classic blacks, the navies and gray, a lot of our, our pieces have color and, you know, style that really kind of push the edge, but still maintain, you know, the professionalism and elegance. Um, and then we also host events. Um, we host events. Everything caters to women in business and helping women reach business, financial, and overall wellness go goals. So full circle caters to women in business. Now, uh, you were also telling me that um, as the summer is coming, you're, you're going to be uh, hosting more events. Absolutely. Right? So talk, yeah, talk a little bit about that. Um, so we hosted our first one when actually the day before we met um, yeah. last time. Which so. was how many? Was that almost a year ago? No, that was just de December. It was in December. <laughs> I know. What? It was just in December, and that was our first in-person event. Okay. Um, we had a very very solid turnout. Um, we sold out within 24 hours of you know we had a great turnout. We partnered with the Fresno area Hispanic Foundation mm -hmm. and a local real estate agent Jackie Lyde, and um, we just had a great turnout. It was just about connecting women and supporting a great cause, which was um, a local nonprofit that works with uh, women who are um, survivors of abuse and, and domestic violence. Okay. And so we did like um, a fundraiser and a drive to collect clothing and, and you know, funds for them. So um, that was an incredible turnout. And so I want to every quarter create an event that brings our local 
women in business together and we wouldn't turn away men like you know it's just we just cater to women that's who you know the brand caters to mostly but um we hosted another one um again in conjunction with the fresno area hispanic foundation that had more of an educational component um you know just helping women reach the next step in their businesses and so it had more of a sales and branding focus um, the next one, I think, is going to be a little bit more fun. We're going to get to get dressed up and, and just, you know, go out and, and network and have some fun. Um, less business, more just, of the dusk uh-huh, part yeah, of exactly. desk to desk. Yeah yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's the whole brand. <laughs> right, right. Full circle. So um, one thing you, you uh, I remember when I met you, you came in and you, you just have this really groovy, hip feel um, t- today you've got this very interesting, gr- it's like a dark green, mm-hmm. right? Kind of talk. And then I love that you've got your shoes, which we can't see on camera. Yeah. <laughs> but, um, tell me what, what, what is trending right now? What's trending right now? Quite honestly, like I don't subscribe to trends so much. Mm-hmm. I, I love to just, if if it feels good, I'm wearing it. Mm-hmm. Um, I gravitate towards brighter colors. Um, I mean, I love a good black outfit, um, but I tend to gravitate towards things based on my mood. And color psychology is a real thing. I don't is know. If, it? I don't know if you've ever heard of it, but I've, I think I have. But I want to yes. hear it more. <laughs> you know, um, so you look at McDonald's, In and Out, Carl's yeah. Jr. Most of the restaurant chains, they all all of their logos are red and yellow, right? And there's a reason behind that. Apparently, according to scientists somewhere, I don't have the the, <laughs> the study data. We'll find that out right. later on. But you know, those colors evoke hunger, wow. and um, I mean, each color evokes a different emotion or, or various emotions. Well, and I you know, I have heard that like um, you know. When Trump was president, he he always wore that red right, tie, right. you know. And uh, so, either a red tie or a blue tie, mm-hmm. depending if you want to show strength mm-hmm. or you. So yeah, yeah. I, I have heard about right. that, but uh, in business, it's probably even more real of a thing. Sure, and you know, in some industries, you get to be a little bit more creative with yeah. your with what you're wearing than others. Um, but I think we're also moving in a direction to where we're not so constrained to what um, was once the the norm or right. what was once expected, you know, of being professional. So, you know, as long as, you know, you feel good, it fits well. Mm-hmm. Um, and I think color is okay to incorporate in your in your work wardrobe. And so for me, this is what I was, you know, feeling. feeling to, I was feeling green today. So, um, you know, it's I. It's spring. It is spring. Yeah, so it is spring. Um, but, you know, I think what you wear tells a little bit of a story about who you are. Yeah. Um, and I think style is one of those things that you get to say something without even opening your mouth. Yeah. So yeah. Um, you have, whether we want to know it or not, or want to admit it or not, like our first impressions actually are, you know, monumental oh, yeah. in yeah. how, you know, the people perceive us and, you know, if there's going to be another interaction with that person. So um, I think our clothes tell a little bit of, uh, of a story about us before we start speaking. So Now, I, well, I think when, when you came in, I was probably in a suit that day. Uh-huh. Um, I've kind of changed my wardrobe. So for Central Valley Talk, I'm more relaxed okay. now mm-hmm. um and then for my new evening news i've got the suit on right. um that's just i don't know if that's me just being lazy no <laughs> you know, but yeah. I, i'm doing it because central valley talk is uh, we're just having a conversation right, right? so um I'm, I, but it is it's fascinating to me how much what you wear and how you look sometimes can make or break a deal absolutely Absolutely. And, you know, I don't think, you know, I might love a good pants suit. Like, Mm -hmm. you know, this green jacket comes with matching green pants. But did I wear it today? Mm -hmm. No, because, Mm -hmm. you know, it's more of a casual setting. I mean, it's not, you know, business casual. Business Mm -hmm. casual. So, um, you know, where you are can kind of determine what you wear. Um, It doesn't mean you have to be suited and booted to everything. It's just, you know, based on the setting and based on how you're feeling and, and what you want to tell as far right. as like what little story you want to tell i think you know that's how you should pick your outfit and and uh for for any uh, women that are watching today or on our replay um why connect with you and and and, and allow them to learn from you sure 
So Desk to Desk is so focused on empowering women. Um, when you feel good and you look good, you do good. And I think it's all interconnected. And that's what the brand really stands on. Um, being a small business, I believe I have so much power in be able, being able to connect one-on-one -on -one with every single customer. Um, it, it would be easier to just, you know, have things just run through the website and, and not have that one-on-one -on -one connection. But for me, it's so important to connect with each customer if I can. Um, so just this year or this last month, we uh -huh. launched our boxes. Um, boxes is basically a wardrobe in a box, and we have different tiers. Because oh. um, a lot of the women that I work with are doing speaking events, are doing you know, uh, you know, networking events, yeah. and just out and about in the community or building their businesses or their careers. And they need more than just one outfit here and there. And yes. so um, you end up getting a lot more pieces at a discounted rate. So those boxes are working really well. And that comes with a styling session. So I sit down with each customer oh. and we go over what their body type is, their body measurements. And we really find outfits based on what their goals are, what their style is. Because I don't want them to wear what I would wear. I want them to wear what they want to what wear. They yeah. wanna wear and you can feel give your good input in. on oh, absolutely. Well, maybe, maybe not this uh, color on, right. on this. You know, so yeah. yeah. Um, well, that, that's freaking awesome. Um, we'll we'll have to come back in a few months again and update us because it sounds like you're just continuing to 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 grow and and, and advance. And then the events that's coming up, that's awesome. Too, yes, so. I'm I'm really excited about everything that's happening. You know, my. My uh, days are full. I don't want to say busy, but my days are full. Yeah. And I'm really excited for, for the direction the company's going in. And I can't wait to, to see where, where else it goes this year. Uh, connect with you. Website is desktodusk.com, right? Yes, All yes. right. Very good. Melissa, good to see you again. Good Thank to see you. you. Thanks, Appreciate Austin. it. Thanks. Have a good, uh, good summer. Oh, you too. Try to stay cool. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I'm Austin Reed. You try to stay cool as well, even though, yeah, it is uh, cooler today. Thank goodness for, for that. But uh, three months from now, it's going to be horrible. Not looking forward to that. Thanks for watching CentralValleyTalk.com.